Are you thinking Tesla is still king in the EV market? In the next few minutes, you'll watch five Chinese EVs smashing Tesla's stopwatch, outcharge its superchargers, and undercut its price tag. One of them adds 300 miles in the time it takes to grab a latte. Be ready, because the future of fast just changed zip codes. Number 5. Xpeng G6 Performance SUV China's answer to the Tesla Model Y. And in 2025, it's not just catching up, it's hitting the gas. Sleeker, smarter, and built on the same 800-volt platform found in some hypercars, the G6 Performance trim comes with a dual-motor setup and a claimed 0 to 60 time of just 4.1 seconds, and Tesla Model Y 0 to 60 mile per hour of 4.8 seconds. That's neck and neck with Tesla's long-range variant. But here's where Xpeng really starts pulling ahead. While the Model Y still charges using a 400-volt architecture, the G6 takes it to the next level. Plug into an ultra-fast charger, and you'll jump from 10 to 80% in under 19 minutes. That's Porsche Taycan territory. While on the other hand, Tesla Model Y 0 to 80% in 25 minutes. When it comes to range, it's no slouch either. The long-range G6 can push over 350 miles on a single charge, verified under China's CLTC cycle. It includes batteries, intelligent thermal management, and it's proving solid in real-world winter testing, while Tesla Model Y push over 330 miles on a single charge. But the real punch comes when you look at the price tag. In China, the G6 performance starts around $54,000. That's nearly $10,000 less than a similarly specced Model Y LR in the US. It also comes stacked with tech, autonomous highway driving, voice-controlled everything, and one of the most intuitive cockpit displays in the game, powered by Xpeng's custom in-house OS. Xpeng didn't build the G6 to be a Tesla killer. They built it to be better, faster to charge, sharper to drive, and significantly cheaper. And if you think the Model Y's crown is secure, Xpeng's coming for it, with a vengeance. Number four, Xiaomi SU7 Max. Coming in at number four is a name that might surprise you, but in 2025, it really shouldn't. The Xiaomi SU7 Max is the debut performance EV from the tech giant best known for smartphones. But this isn't some experimental side project, it's a fully realized road legal statement that says, we're not just entering the EV game, we're rewriting it. Underneath its elegant fastback body, the SU7 Max is a silent assassin. Dual motors generate over 660 horsepower, launching the car from 0 to 60 in just 2.78 seconds. That's faster than a BMW M5, quicker than a Porsche Taycan 4S, and almost in Tesla Plaid territory, all while looking like it rolled out of a Blade Runner sequel. But power is just part of the story. The real flex is in the range, a staggering 497 miles on a single charge, because it has 101 kilowatt hour battery pack and Xiaomi's proprietary efficiency algorithms. And it's not just long legs, it's lightning fast on recharge too. With its 800 volt architecture and dual plug 480 kilowatt charging system, the SU7 Max can recover up to 80% of its battery in just 15 minutes, which puts it among the fastest charging EVs on Earth. Inside, it's a tech lover's paradise. The entire cabin is essentially one massive, connected smart device, seamlessly syncing with Xiaomi phones, smart homes, and even wearables. The infotainment is powered by Xiaomi's Hyper OS, offering buttery smooth UI and near instant voice control. It's like stepping into the future and realizing the future is already here. And here's the knockout punch. In China, the SU7 Max starts at around $41,500. That's less than a base Tesla Model 3 in the US. For a car that's quicker, smarter, and more luxurious, Xiaomi didn't just build a Tesla competitor. They may have built a Tesla disruptor. It's rare that a brand new car from a brand new automaker hits this hard on the first try. But the SU7 Max proves that Xiaomi isn't just joining the EV race. They're already overtaking. Number 3. Neo ET7 Ultra Range Edition At number 3, we have a car that didn't just beat Tesla. It beat a world record. 
This is the NEO ET7 Ultra Range, equipped with the first ever mass-produced 150 kilowatt hour semi-solid state battery pack, and it just proved something remarkable, over 649 miles, on a single charge, in a real-world test, from Shanghai to Xiamen, without stopping to plug in. This isn't just a range boost, it's a leap in EV technology. The semi-solid state chemistry delivers energy density that traditional lithium-ion batteries can't match, and NEO has done what many said was still years away. Just real-world endurance, filmed and verified. And don't think it's all about distance. The ET7 is no slouch on performance with a dual-motor all-wheel drive setup delivering nearly 650 horsepower. It accelerates from 0 to 60 in just under 4 seconds. It glides like a luxury sedan, but moves like a sports car. The suspension is adaptive. The interior is minimalist and elegant, wrapped in sustainable materials, framed by ambient lighting, and dominated by a powerful AI assistant named Nomi, which learns your preferences as you drive. But perhaps the most futuristic piece of the puzzle isn't even inside the car, it's underneath it. Instead of waiting 40 minutes at a charging station, NEO drivers in China can now pull into one of over 2,000 battery swap stations, where robotic arms automatically replace your depleted battery with a fresh, fully charged one in under 5 minutes. And while Tesla continues to focus on superchargers, NEO is quietly building an ecosystem that could change how we think about EV ownership altogether. The NEO ET7 isn't trying to win on theatrics. It wins on stamina, on infrastructure, and on quiet luxury. It may not be the fastest, it may not be the flashiest, but in a world where range anxiety still haunts most drivers, the ET7 is a calm, confident answer. And right now, it's the long distance king. Number two, Zeker 001 FR, the electric super wagon. If you thought wagons were for groceries and soccer practice, think again. The Zeker 001 FR is a performance monster disguised as a family cruiser. And in 2025, it's one of the few EVs on earth that can go toe to toe with the Tesla Model S Plaid and actually land a punch. Let's start with the numbers, because that's where jaws start dropping. This four-door shooting brake is packing four electric motors, one at each wheel, producing a combined 1,265 horsepower. That kind of firepower launches the Zeker from 0 to 60 in just over 2 seconds, with a rolling start time measured at a ridiculous 2.07 seconds. That's not just fast, that's hypercar fast. Yet this car has a liftgate and rear seats that fold down, but the 001 FR doesn't just accelerate in a straight line. It corners like a scalpel because of its intelligent torque vectoring system. And track tuned suspension, it grips like a performance coupe, not a five-door estate. Zeker's engineers didn't hold back. They fitted carbon ceramic brakes, performance rubber, and an aero package that actually functions. This isn't a software gimmick or a badge engineering job. It's a no-compromise electric powerhouse built from the ground up. And here's the crazy part. This isn't a prototype or a concept car. Zeker is building and delivering the 001 FR right now. It's a limited-run vehicle with around 99 units produced per month, aimed at enthusiasts who want something wildly different from the usual sedan or crossover. And it's not cheap. Expect pricing to land north of $140,000, but that still undercuts most supercars it can outperform. The interior? Exactly what you'd expect from a Geely-backed luxury EV. Soft-touch materials, ambient lighting, dual floating displays, and one of the most responsive infotainment systems in the market. It's high-end, high-tech, and unapologetically driver-focused. And just like its rivals, it's built on an 800-volt electrical architecture, allowing it to juice up from 10 to 80% in around 15 minutes. That means you don't just get track day performance, you get convenience that works on real roads, in real life. The Zeker 001 FR is a unicorn. It's part luxury wagon, part electric missile, and part science experiment. And it proves that Chinese EV makers are no longer following Tesla. They're challenging it. And in some cases, like this one, they're flat out beating it. Number 1. BYD Yangwang U9 
the jumping hypercar that breaks all the rules. We have a car that feels more like science fiction than anything with a license plate. BYD Yangwang U9, a four-door hypercar that doesn't just compete with Tesla, it makes Tesla's fastest cars look safe. This is the wild child of BYD's new ultra-luxury brand, Yangwang. And in 2025, the U9 isn't just one of the most powerful EVs on the road, it's one of the most advanced vehicles in the world. The U9 launches from 0 to 60 in just over 2.3 seconds. And if you push it a little harder, it'll tear through the quarter mile in under 10 seconds. And it doesn't stop until it hits a blistering 192 miles per hour. That's the kind of speed that makes even a Taycan Turbo GT look over its shoulder. But here's what truly sets the U9 apart. It's not just fast in a straight line. It's built on BYD's revolutionary quad motor platform, which gives each wheel its own motor and independent torque control. That means the U9 can do things no traditional car or even most EVs can do. It can pivot on the spot. It can crab walk. And thanks to BYD's DSUS X active suspension system, it can literally jump like wheels off the ground, suspension powered lift. It's part showpiece, part engineering showcase, and it's unlike anything the industry has seen before. Visually, the U9 looks like it belongs in a Marvel movie. Its body is sculpted for aerodynamic perfection with LED strips that pulse like a heartbeat and an active rear wing that rises like a fighter jet's air brake. The lighting package isn't just flashy, it communicates with pedestrians and other drivers, part of the vehicle's built-in smart awareness system. Inside, the cabin is a blend of race car and luxury lounge. High-end materials meet cutting-edge tech, with everything from surround view HUDs to an immersive infotainment system that responds instantly. You feel like you're piloting a spacecraft, just one that happens to have heated massage seats. And while most EV hypercars hover around the million dollar mark, the U9 comes in at roughly $233,000 USD. That's still a fortune, but when you consider the performance, the tech, and the theater of it all, it's half the price of a Remac Nevera and arguably twice as bold. The BYD Yonglong U9 isn't trying to beat Tesla at its own game. It's inventing a whole new one. This car doesn't just blur the line between science fiction and reality. It erases it, and in doing so, it might just be the most outrageous and most important electric car of 2025. Five electric monsters, five wake-up calls, and one undeniable truth. The EV crown is no longer Tesla's to keep. China isn't catching up, it's taking over. One insane innovation at a time. While Tesla pushes updates, these companies are rewriting the rules. From battery swap tech that beats gas station stops, to suspensions that make a car literally jump. This isn't a trend, it's a tectonic shift. And if you're still sleeping on Chinese EVs, consider this.